and welcome back to another Dollar Tree haul with me, Margo. I hope you guys are ready for Christmas because it's here. Um, I am ready, although I used to be ready way more in advance than I was this year, but that's okay. It all came together. I am, um, I'm ready. And I do have a large Dollar Tree haul for you guys. I don't think I have it in any type of order, but let's get into it. All right, so I have this Yardley London. You guys know how much I love that stuff. Moisturizing hand soap. This one is lemon with orange essential oils. Love, love this stuff. Actually, I did not smell this one. And this is the 14 fluid ounce. I bet you it smells good. Of course, of course. All right, so I did get the lemon. And I also found the Berry Blossom. And again, same thing, 12 ounces. I really, really, really like this soap. Oh, that does smell good. It does. My favorite, of course, is the um, Oatmeal Almond. But, all right, and then another Yardley product is the Lemon, but this is the Hand Lotion. And I believe this is, let's see, I can't read the ounces on here. No. Okay, so that's the Yardley London, the Lemon Lotion. So I found the lotion, the hand soap, and the candles all in that same scent. Then I did pick up this body wash for the little ones, and it's the Disney Encanto, of course. I did get two of those. And we needed some rubbing alcohol, so I picked some up. And this has an expiration date of 9-13-2025, and it's 16 fluid ounces. All right, I did get a white oversized t-shirt, and I'm going to tie-dye it for myself. And I also picked one up for uh, one of my nieces, because she loves to tie-dye. All right, and I have, I bought these in the past where I bought, I think it was this one, uh, 31 and a half inch by 23 and a half inch. Funny story. Well, there's two of them. There's this one and then there's this one. Nice until proven naughty. That's what that looks like. And this is what that one looks like. These are pretty big too. But I did purchase these to put my niece's uh, stuff in, the, in, in here. And my husband had called me and, or he texted me and said, do you still have any of those big bags? And I wasn't sure exactly what he meant, but when he came home, he told me, he, well, in the text, it also said, I want to make shorts out of them. I'm like, what, for my Christmas outfit? So he meant these bags here. So I picked up one of each for him so he can make his little Christmas shorts. I'll take a picture, you guys. And he says he wants to wear them Christmas Eve and Christmas Day. So let's see. All right. I was happy to find these. These are the Arm & Hammer. It's 30 in a pack, but it's the Ultra Max Advanced Odor Control Face and Body Wipes. And they also have it in the um, Sensitive Skin. Um, I don't have Sensitive Skin, but I did pick this up and... I'll give it a try. Give it a try. If I like it, I'll pick up some more. I did find find these. Um, well, one of my subscribers had told me about these. And she said, if you find any, Margo, can you pick one up? And so I did. Well, actually, I picked up a few of them. Digital FM transmitter. Not sure exactly what this is. It does show, like, with a phone there. Let's see. Uh, oversized display for easy viewing by the Skosh brand. I, I am not 100% sure. It is made in the United States. Um, works with iPad, iPhone, iPad, um, iPod, and Android device, smartphones, tablets, and more. I don't know. I'll check it out, though. But I'm sure it's not $1.25 at <laughs> in another store all right so let me see let me pull some stuff here i bought these i do have two packs i'm not sure oh it's right up there um two packs of these 
So I bought two packs of these. They're eight in a, in a pack. But the reason I bought these, I'm not going to be canning. Um, I had seen on, I'm not sure if it was TikTok or Etsy, but it's kind of like this. You make a pumpkin out of it. So you get all these pieces put around together and then spray paint it. So I'll give that a whirl. All right, so for Christmas, you guys know I do live in Connecticut. Uh, we have a lot of New England Patriots fan here. So I'm going to actually make a basket with um, New England Patriots items, and there's a lot. There's a lot. So there's quite a few different containers. Here's one of them. Um, this one right here is freezable. So this part right here, you freeze. Then you put it back over this, and it has the New England Patriots on the, the lid. So we have that one. Um, this one is a two-pack of Patriots. It's got the lids also with it. Then there's this one with the helmets. It pops open, and it has this little lip thing on top so i think you can use this for soup then there was this one this size right here this one's also a freezable lid and here's the inside the lid has the patriots uh, emblem on it so that'll go in the baskets and this one is a sandwich holder or bread, whichever, whatever you want to put in, put in there. Um, let's see what else do we have. Patriots. We have some magnets. Let me get those. Here is one of them. These are pretty heavy too. There's another one. And these are ceramic coasters. I did get two. And the back of these are cork. So that way it doesn't scratch your table or anything like that. Then there is this New England Patriots Admit One Lifetime Membership. It looks like a ticket, but it's framed, which I think is pretty cool. And then you can also hang it if you'd like in the back. There's a thing here. So yeah, there's this. Um, there is stir sticks. It's an eight piece drink stirs. And it has the emblems on the tops of them. And here's the back. Then there is this. This is so cool looking. It's a triangle like platter. Pretty cool. Made out of plastic. But I like that. I like that a lot. I don't think they're going to be in the Super Bowl, but this would have been cool for the Super Bowl. Actually, if you're just a Patriots fan, it's cool for the Super Bowl anyways. Here's a bowl. It's pretty big. And two more Patriots items. This is like a vegetable tray, I guess. That's pretty big. Look how big. You can put your dip in the middle and then all your vegetables around or chips, pretzels, whatever. Whichever. And then the last platter. Pretty big. Oh, that's upside down, isn't it? There we go. So yeah, some cool Patriot stuff. I think that basket's going to look pretty cool. And it's probably going to cost under $15, I bet. I bet. Or close to anyways. All right. So, um, I did get this for the kitties stocking. It's a three-pack of Beef Eaters Lickable Puree Cat Treat. And this one is Tuna Recipe. I've never bought these before, but when we go to the vet, this is what they use, the um, Lickables. And the cats like it, so I figured I'd try it. And here's the back. And this is three 
0.53 ounce packages. Total weight, 1.59 ounce. And I have some pretty cool items from Crafter Square. Now they're calling these wood slice, like all of them, which is really cool. I did not buy any of the, like the birch wood or those, because I have um, some here that my husband cut up from like a grapevine and I use those for like pumpkin tops and stuff. But when I saw these, I said, oh my goodness, like the sanding alone, okay? These are already sanded for me, so that'll be going in my craft stash. Then they had this style right here. These are pretty cool too. And then they call these wood slices, but they're, they actually look like, I don't know, branches, I guess. But they're, again, they're sanded. So less work for me. Yeah, but look, they have a, seems like that's a branch. These are pretty cool. These ones are more like the wooden dowels. These ones look more like a, uniformed I guess in size and the other ones had um like branches coming up all right so then I saw this this is something new to me it's called chrome nail powder and it's by be pure and it says with one applicator never tried anything like this before I don't know so we'll, we'll give it a whirl so that's that. If anybody has ever used this type of stuff before, let me know how difficult it is to use or how easy it is to use. All right, so I have, um, I picked up a few of these little skateboard things. These are actually for my niece's boyfriend. Um, so these are newer ones, but they're the finger boards. He likes these. So that's one of them. There's this one. And this one. And in the toy section again, this is actually Barbie and Ken. They are outfits, but it's the Barbie brand and it comes with a little hanger, which I think is adorable. So this one is for Ken and it looks like he has slide shoes, a shirt, I'm not sure what that those black things are. Oh, shorts. oh yeah, the shorts. Yes, the shorts. Yep. So this one is for Ken. This is all Barbie accessories. Oh my goodness. There's uh, shoes, cameras, sunglasses, face mask, uh, sun visor, pillow for like the plane and stuff. Looks like a purse. Headphone, this is really cool. I, I know this has got to be more than a dollar twenty-five in um you know outside of Dollar Tree. And it, again, it comes with a hanger. Very cute, very cute. And it's Barbie brand, so can't beat that. All right, and this one I believe is Barbie. Okay, so it's the shorts, the shirt, and the fanny pack. Very cute. Like I said, Barbie brand. Can't beat that, right? And then we have the chef outfit. It looks like pants, chef coat, and a pot. So that is an awesome, awesome gift. All right, and then we have more Barbie accessories. We have sunglasses, hair bands, uh, a face mask again, boots, a cute little purse. It looks like a Vera Bradley. Look at that, that's adorable. Awesome, awesome. So if you put all these accessories with a Barbie, under $20, great gift, great, great gift. Okay, so I've seen a lot of people hauling these. There's six pieces in here and it's by Sherwood. It's premium chocolate with caramel filling truffle and it's a three ounce package. 
So I'm probably going to throw these on the uh, charcuterie board along with these. These are the Crispy Delicious Choco Biscuits. And this is a 2.8 ounce. And here are the nutritional facts for this. So I think that'll look nice. See, it's kind of like decorative, so I think that'll look good on the charcuterie board. I'm going to show you guys pictures of that when we make them. My husband's doing the charcuterie board, and I'm going to do the charcuterie board. All right, we needed paper plates, and I was at Dollar Tree, so I picked them up. You get 15 of them. These ones are pretty decent. 15 count for $1.25. So for $2.50, I got 30 plates. I don't think that that's too bad. All right, I did find this new, well, new to me, the Harry and David, which is a great, great brand. This one is sweet and spicy snack mix. Uh, honey roasted peanuts, hot Cajun sesame sticks, butter toffee peanuts, corn nuts, honey sweet sticks, and zesty peanuts. This is a 2.5 ounce. And this one is Best Buy 10323. And here's the nutritional facts on that. But they had so many Harry and David um, products. Like, I've seen a few people, too, on YouTube making baskets out of them. Like, why not? This stuff is great. So I picked up these, two. Uh, a couple of makeup items. This one is CoverGirl. CoverGirl, what is it? Oh, boy. Hard to see. But it is a lip product. And I'm thinking that Dollar Tree, this is like, I believe Dollar Tree put it in this, this bag, this iridescent bag, which is a good idea because I have this one from, uh, what did I say, Maybelline, and then this one is by CoverGirl, and this one is the melting pot, again, for the lips, but look, it's in the same type of packaging. Here's the back. So, I mean, that's pretty smart of Dollar Tree to do that. It really makes it stand out. So, anyways, I have these. Oh, yeah, and then this one. This one is L'Oreal Infallibles. Again, another lip product. But I think that's very smart to put it in these iridescent bags. Pretty cool. All right. And then I did get this Yes to Coconut Hydrate and Restore Protecting Hand and Cuticle Cream. And let's see, the size on this is a three fluid ounce and a natural 97%, I guess it's 90, uh, paraben free, natural product, and it says 97%. So I wonder if this is, I bet you it smells good. Nice to see, it's got the little tab on it. Oh my goodness. Wow, that's a strong coconut smell. Awesome. Okay, and like I said, this is a long haul. We're almost done. I did finally find these. I've seen so many people hauling these. I know these are in the pet section, and it says, you know, let me do this. There we go. It says yummy all the way around. And then this is the lid. There is no indication that this is for pets. So this is really cute to put little anything, anything yummy <laughs> in here. All right. And then the last two items I purchased are reusable bags. These ones are the big ones. This one's beautiful, look at that. This is the, the, like I said, the big ones, and it's just a solid size. Sides. Uh, speak much, Margo. And then this one right here. This one's beautiful, too. With the flowers. And it's got the solid sides. These are by Juncture. All right, guys. So that is it for this haul. Let me get you some prices. Okay, for this haul, oh my goodness, stop rolling. 
All right, guys, so let me get you some prices. What I paid for this haul was $73.75, and again, that's before tax. Had I gone to Walmart, Target, Amazon, like I say, outside of Dollar Tree, it would have been approximately $241.77, and that's a big difference of $168.02, and again, that's why I love Dollar Tree. All right, guys, I do want to thank you all for um, like, comment, and subscribe. If you are not subscribed, I would love it if you became part of our YouTube family. And guys, if you give me a thumbs up, leave me a comment, it all helps my channel, and I really would appreciate it. Um, also, I did not hear from Holly yet, the winner. I'll give her a few more days from my mystery gift box giveaway and if i don't hear from holly within the next few days like right after christmas then i will just pick another name but that is it for now and i hope you guys all have a very very merry christmas a safe christmas love you guys be good and uh love you bye